Hey guys, how's it going? It's Trax here, and today we're playing Maple Story. Okay, so it's been a while since I did a video on Maple Story. <laughs> it's been like two years. Um, recently during the quarantine, I've picked up the game again. So yeah, I um made a Phantom, and I got that to level 200. I also made a Shade, which I also leveled up to 200. Um, right now there's a Terror Bird. Oh, that a terror burning event right now <laughs> and that allows you to basically gain three levels um every single time you level up so if you level if you level up once you get two levels so that's basically three levels in total so and it's all the way up to 202 which is great um so it's a lot easier to get to level 200 now um but it's only during this event usually they have some like mega burning event something like that that uh, allows you to gain, you know, you know, two levels every single every single time you level up up until level 150. So, yeah, um, this phantom is not terror burn, so I actually had to grind all 200 levels <laughs> or 199 levels. Um, but yeah, in today's video, I'm basically just gonna do some random bossing stuff and just talk about, you know, um, some stuff I noticed in uh, coming back in this game. <laughs> Um, but yeah, let's show you guys some of my equips. Um, uh, I'm not really that funded. Um, I think that's still the term now. Uh, I, I'm a very old Maple Story player, so yeah, I still use the old lingos. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys some of my equips. Like, it, it's not great. <laughs> I don't even have my arcane thingy. <laughs> I don't even know what it is. Um, but yeah, I don't plan on leveling up any further than 200. Like, I think 200 is basically the highest I'm gonna get on any single character, because uh, getting to level 210 and anything higher than that is gonna be a complete pain in the butt, and, like, the amount of grinding you have to do is, a, is a, a pain, so I don't think I'm gonna really get to level 210 or anything like that. Um, honestly, after the quarantine's over, I'm probably gonna quit this game again. <laughs> um, but yeah, it was a lot of fun, though. I, a lot of stuff had changed. Um... So I just go through my equips too, um, and I'll stop rambling. So I have my evolving ring, this is old. I have my evolving ring 3, which is old. <laughs> um, I'm not sure it shows the uh, the date. Yeah, it doesn't show the date, so I don't, remember, I don't even remember when this even came out. It was around the time of Big Bang, I believe, so I still have these. Um, I have my fox ring from when Shade came out a while back. Um, it's four percent luck, which <laughs> that's not about it. It's like not really that great. Um, I have my Royal Assassin hood, three percent luck, uh, completely clean. Like most of my equips are clean. Um, it costs a lot to scroll, and your boy's broke. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah. Anyways, I have my condensed power crystal, which is poop. I have my aquatic letter eye accessory, which is poop. Um, reinforced engraved gold pendant. Which is poop. <laughs> I have Absolab uh, for Kane, which actually uh, is it, not only poop, but <laughs> it's it not scrolls, so it's kind of poop. Um, honestly, um, when I first came back to the game, I thought Fafnir's are still the thing, <laughs> but I guess not. Um, Arcane weapons are now the best weapons. Uh, Absolab is like the second best weapon. It really depends on you know what you're wearing. Uh, but Absolab stuff are usually a little bit better than the, um, at least the Fafnir weapon. Um, it's still better to wear the, uh, the Fafnir, you know, clothes or whatever these things are. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, this is my Superior Golux, uh, pen, pen, uh, belt. Uh, it's completely, completely clean, so it's poop. Um, I think that's, yeah, this one. So this is my Eagle Eye Assassin shirt, my Trickster Assassin pants. 4% uh, all stats are pretty good. It, 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 this one also has 4% all stats too. Um, my shoes, which is poop. <laughs> um, what you call it? My uh, earrings, 6% uh, luck. My uh, Royal Black Metal Shoulder, which is poop. Um, Dimension Glove, poop. Actually, mm, that's 23 attack power. That, that, that's not too bad. <laughs> that's still poop. Um, the, the, the gold hero emblem that you get if you, if you level up to like level 100, I believe. Um, the crystal Ventus badge. Uh, poop. 
<laughs> NX Legend. Uh, I think you get this when you get the little 200 for the first time. So when I remember when I first got this medal, I was so hyped. Like seeing everybody with this uh, medal right here, like I was so jealous. <laughs> and I I finally got my own um, a couple years ago. So it, it's not that special anymore. But it's at the same time when I look at it, they're like, wow, I can't believe I got a character level 200. I remember when I first played Maple Story, and I was like, "There's no way I'm getting a character level 200." But uh, I finally did it. <laughs> um, this car thingy, which poop. Um, this cave, which is also poop. Actually, it had hundred. I didn't even notice it. it had hundred luck. Like we got plus a hundred luck, which isn't too bad. Um, so yeah, and then my cash weapons, whatever. Uh, this took me. Like, this is a pain to get. <laughs> I actually had to open one of those premium supply, uh, surprise boxes. And I got really lucky and I actually got one of these. These cost like... Like... I don't even know how much. It used to cost like... 1.7 bill to... Like 2 bill. I don't even know how much it costs now. Because you can't really get this. Um... But yeah, I'm really glad I got, I got this. <laughs> um... But yeah, this is my uh, range. So yeah, it's not really that great. Um... Honestly, I, I probably messed this up too. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have like 200,000 uh, for my range. Was, it's actually really high, like for me anyway. Like, back when I used to play Maple Story, I, I couldn't even break 100,000. Like, the fact that I had 200,000 and all my stuff are clean, it's crazy. Like, I realized that when I came back, upgrading your equipment and stuff like that is a lot easier. And they give a lot more stats than they used to. Like, for example, when I used to get these um, Fafnir uh, equips, they used to just be clean. Like, there is no extra stat boost like that. So, they added that sometime during the two years I was on hiatus. So, <laughs> yeah, it's definitely a lot easier to get a higher range, which is great. Like, I, I used to struggle so much <laughs> getting to 100,000. And the fact that I have clean equips and I have 200,000 range is kind of insane. Um, but yeah, definitely the game changed a lot, and it, it was like it was great, like um, seeing everything that changed and everything that improved. Um, there's still some stuff that you know it's kind of annoying, like um, I'm trying to think. <laughs> I, I guess like even getting cubes isn't too bad. Um, they, I think they recently just changed it where the um, Master Crafting's cubes now are. You know, untradeable. Um, so that that kind of sucks. <laughs> um, but even getting cubes is pretty good. Like they have the um, the daily event, oh, the daily gift thing, where you get some cubes. Like on the 14th day of the month and the 28th day of the month, you also get the bonus key with 27. You also get some other stuff as well, which is great. Um, there right now there is that uh, what you call it, the uh, the maple relay event, which can get you. Uh, a set of 12 cubes. You also get a free Absolab weapon here. Um, at the 80th day, you also get 10,000 maple coins. I mean, Stupid maple coins, <laughs> maple points. Um, uh, which is essentially ten dollars, which is great. Um, and then every single day, if you log in for like three hours, you get like 500 maple points. Um, which is like what, like 50 cents? <laughs> which is still really good. Like it adds up. Like right now, I have um. Of like four thousand, um, I think I spend like I don't know, be like, no, like four thousand, five thousand maybe points. So I could have a lot more than that. Like the game is a lot more free to play friendly than it was before, um, which is great. Like um, even reboot, like reboot is uh, pretty good. But uh, yeah, I'm not really playing on reboot. I am playing on the server Elysium. Uh, hopefully, hopefully that's how you pronounce it. Um, but yeah, I'm having a lot of fun. Um, definitely the, the, the biggest pain that like this is the thing I hated the most about the new Whipple story, um, is the fact that the hairstyles are a little bit different now. So I believe the coupons, or at least like the main hairstyles, not the, not like the royal, but like the VIP and stuff like that, and regular, the, the god now. Um, so now I think there's like a rotation. I'm not exactly sure. How it really works. Um, I didn't really want to. Like, I didn't want to buy the tested out because <laughs> I don't want to waste like three bucks on uh, a hair coupon that I'm not gonna use. 
so yeah i guess i don't really like that maybe i'll have to check it out myself but uh yeah i'm really excited for the adele class which I, i'm not sure if it's coming out tomorrow or um two days from now when, when i'm recording this because right now the 22nd um and adele comes down the 24th i think technically maple story right now is 20 it's like the 23rd so yeah I, I think it might come out tomorrow but i'm not exactly sure but i'm excited for that once I get that class level 200, I'm probably going <laughs> to stop the game, playing the game, I guess. Um, cause like I said before, I'm not really going to grind to level 210. At least that, if, I feel like if I feel like it, I'll do it, but I'm probably not going to do that. Um, but that's kind of about it for this you know, part of the video. I'm just going to you know, fight some bosses and put some music on. Because <laughs> um, you know, commentating during bosses is... Yeah. It is it, <laughs> not really, I guess, interesting. Like, what am I really gonna say? Like, oh, I'm, I'm just spamming like in one button. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm really enjoying the Phantom class. Um, I'm really glad I picked this class up. Uh, I used to really like this class when it first came out, but I didn't really get too into it because, well, leveling back then was still kind of you know a little bit difficult. Um, and I didn't really want to grind. Not only that, but uh. I guess I didn't really have any motivation to play a Phantom, but ever since I've played for Son of Five Royal, uh, <laughs> I uh, really felt like making a Phantom. So that's the only reason why I made a Phantom, and it's probably the only reason why I came out to Maple Story. It was because of Persona Five Royal, um, you know, because I don't know, <laughs> the game was so much fun. So I'm like, I really wanted to make a class Maple Story because the Phantom class is very similar to um, the Phantom Thieves. And also, you guys see my guild, there's a fan of these as well, so, yeah. <laughs> uh, I also did unlock some of my, uh, you know, the fifth job skills for the phantom, like, um, this was like, luck of the draw, the ace in the hole, phantom's mark. I have no idea what the phantom's mark even is. Um, ace in the hole is pretty interesting, like, if you use that, it can basically attacks the enemies, um, in the field. And luck of the draw is pretty cool too. But uh, it has a really long cooldown, and I'm not really sure how it works. <laughs> um, essentially, I'm kind of a scrub at this, so I don't know how any of these job skills work. So if, if you guys see me during the bossing part of this video, it's like struggling to use these skills, that's why. Um, and honestly, don't expect me to fight any hard bosses. Like in the bossing part, I'm really just gonna fight normal Rutabis bosses, maybe like normal Zackum, normal Horntail, maybe Hilla. And easy magnet stuff like that, stuff like that. So it's not really gonna be anything crazy. I'm just, I really just want to make this video to talk about, you know, my experience with coming back to Maple Story and basically just kind of make a video, you know, showing off the the skills of the Phantom, whatever. Because <laughs> um, this is what I usually do when I get a class level 200. I usually make a video, just showing the skills, and then never playing the class ever again. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want more Maple Story videos. Definitely hit the like and subscribe button, um, and let me know in the comment section below. I, I'm not really gonna come back to Maple Story, but if you guys want Maple Story videos, I might do some here and there. But for the most part, I really don't think I'm gonna come back. But uh, yeah, anyways, enough rambling. I'm gonna get right into the boss thing. So yeah, I think kind of everything I wanted to say. So yeah, anyways, hope you enjoyed the rest of uh, this video, and yeah, hopefully you guys look forward to the next video where I. Uh, showcase my shade because i actually like the shade a lot like the shade class a lot so yeah anyways hope you enjoyed the rest of the video and i'll see you guys later
Persona! I'm a sad man. 